Each week, Dorito Brothers Auto Dealers take us inside Cal High Sports with stories on athletes who are outstanding for a variety of reasons. Yeah, and Therese, as you know, and as anyone knows who's watched this show at all over the past many years, if there's food involved, I'm your man. So when I heard about a snack shack making the freshest, most wholesome, homemade food in the Bay Area, I was there. Inside Cal High Sports. Welcome to More Cooking with Renee. Now here's your host, Renee Moore. Renee, what's on the menu today? I'm making some old-fashioned chocolate chip cookies. Our chef, Renee, uses only the freshest, most wholesome ingredients, even in her cookies. I've got some organic butters. The final product goes here to the Snack Shack at Menlo Atherton High School. It's a wholesome way to enjoy the game. Well, I just, when I took over the shack, I wanted to offer healthier choices for the kids. And so basically what I've done is I make everything uh, myself. So there, there are very few preservatives and um, I offer fresh fruit and salads. Um, I won't sell candy and I don't sell soda. Of course, when Renee cooks, you always get more. Look at all of this. The dessert section alone looks like something out of a five-star restaurant. There is more traditional fare, but even the pulled pork is freshly made in a crock pot with two sauces to choose from, and it comes with Renee's spicy coleslaw. Thank Look you. at that. I can't beat that. Where else can you get this? Back at the barbecue are the expected hot dogs, but these are nitrate-free. Even the nachos are made with organic cheese. And there is a green element with all the biodegradable products. Renee does all of the cooking, but she does get lots of help from the volunteers. Still, it's a huge amount of work for Renee, who plans to do it all again next year, but with a little more help in the managing side. So next year, she can watch her son play in his senior season. Meantime, after the cookies go into the oven, Renee moves on to her next dish. This is my um, Chinese chicken salad. And I'm always trying to throw vegetables into things without people really knowing that they're getting a big variety. It's really different and it's like, it feels more like a dinner, so I feel like I can really eat more food here and stuff like that and not be so, go home and have to eat more food. So it's, it's, I love the food here, the teriyaki uh, chicken, the, uh, the bull uh, pork that they have, the cheeseburger. It's, it's definitely better than most schools, like, so I like it. With this kind of praise, our chef Renee has proven you can serve wholesome food at a snack shack and succeed. This final home game of the season, snack shack sales pulled in $3,000 in profit. Great job, Renee. Be sure to tune in next season when Menlo Atherton High School has more cooking with Renee. Of course, Renee kindly gave us some samples. I brought it back to the office and Therese ate almost all of it. It's the truth. Oh well. What can you say? <laughs> what can you say? 